Hey, you guys. Welcome back to Crazy Quilts and Crafts with SCK. You guys, I got another to-do pattern done. Yes, you guys. I finally got to another pattern. I've been wanting to do this. Yes, Valentine's Day has passed and moved on for next year. But I still said I got to get this project done because I really wanted to do it. And I love the way it turned out. This is a free pattern on Fat Quarter Shop called Love Notes Quilt Pattern. And you could pull the uh, PDF um, file and print it out. It is a very, uh, I would say this is a beginner-friendly project. If you can get this done, you could get any quilt done. This is a great um, beginner's project. It's a great intro into the quilt world. Um, it's a nice size. I believe mine's came out to be like a 20 by 20. I think on the website it's probably like 16 by 16, maybe something like that. But, um, I love the way I use all my Valentine's, um, day fabrics along with some of my Barbie fabrics that had complimented it. I was able to exercise my, um, what is it called? You guys fussy cut. I was able to exercise the fussy cut, and I love the way it came out. In certain areas, I could have did better with the fussy cut, but for the, the overall, it came out really nice the way I expected it to come out. So I also used some of my gnomes and the hard black fabric, my um, the candy uh, kiss hugs and um, love you um, fabric. I love the way this came out. I really, really love the way that came out. Now, these over here is my fabrics that I've been using in my Barbie projects. This is um, Tula Pink um, Black and White Polka Dots. And on the back of it, well, let me stay on the front because I did quilt and I stitched in a ditch. And I could come in a little closer so you guys can see that. In some areas, I did hit um, the fabric, but that's okay. Like over here, I had hit the fabric, but that's okay. Um, on the back end, I love the way it came out on the back end as well. I use this beautiful um, heart fabric here. And this is what the back is looking like. And I like the way it came out. And I did make sure that I used thread that was going to complement that I can see on the back end. So you can see I, with the um, stitch in the ditch, I, went, um, I outlined it, the heart. So you can see that on the back. And as far as the added borders, I went around on the borders where I did the fuzzy cutting, so you can actually see that as well. So, this project was super fun to do. I can't wait to bust out some more of these. Great um, quick gifts to give. Great to have um, hanging around your house during the Valentine's Day season. Again, the fussy cut was very fun. So, as you can see with the fussy cut, this came in really nice, especially in this area as well. I don't know what happened on my top and my bottom. I don't I don't know how I was not able to uh get the um print in as well as I did on my left and my right side and as well as I did in this area. This area came out. This area came out. I'm sorry about that you guys. This area came out really good. And see on the top I missed it in here too. And I don't know if I just got happy um getting to the completion of it but that's what happened but as far as my miter corners when i tell you my miters is coming out um really good as i continue into my quilt world that one came out really good i was able to catch it and this one came out super good look how look how nice that one came out i would have preferred for that stitch to be in here as I was pivoting, but that's okay. And I did leave two, um, I think it was two and a half inches of the backing fabric out so that I can do my binding, which that was fun to do like that because y'all know I always bind the other way. Um, so I am definitely working on my skills. So again, this is the um, pattern on Fat Quarter Shop. Free pattern, go print it out, PDF, print it, and give it a try. Um, so this is my version of Love Notes. All right, family, I hope you guys enjoyed this show and tell. And I will see you guys on the next video. Peace. Thank you for tuning in.